internet friends, welcome to another episode of the Synergy Cafe online show featuring speaker, entertainer, close-up illusionist, and marketing alchemist, Magic Brad. It's the internet lifestyle show about career, finance, relationships, spirituality, and wellness. We're moving the online chatter over to real life activity. And now, please welcome your host of Synergy Cafe, Magic Brad. Hey, internet friends, Magic Brad, Synergy Cafe, and the Synergy Collaborative. And I've got a new friend on the line. His name is Jason Troy, and I think he's just south of us in... Is he in Texas? You there? Yes, Dallas. Dallas. I've been there. I drove right down 35W. <laughs> yes. Well, We're up not that far from me. No. Just a, just a quick drive. Yes. So I don't uh, take too much time when I do these. I try and keep them kind of condensed so that people can uh, go out and get their things done and they can learn about you and uh, things of that okay. sort. So we start with, who are you? Are you uh, you're married? You got kids? You got pets? Who's, who's Jason? Uh, well, in my business life, I'm a business and executive coach. In my personal life, I have a dog. It's a 15 year old Jack Russell Terrier. I live in downtown Dallas. Big Cowboys fan. I was actually at the game yesterday. Go to most of the home games. Big Mavericks fan. Big travel fan. Um, you know, got to restaurants, do a lot of charity work, work with nonprofits, and just you know, enjoy my life and have fun and help people. Stay busy. Yes. So the next question is what? What do you do? So you're a business coach? Is that what you said? A business and executive coach. So I work with senior level leaders from CEOs um, to chairmen, all the way sort of throughout an organization, also with successful entrepreneurs. Usually they're coming to me because they're stuck and they're having some significant pain in their life, whether it's some blind spots that are causing them problems that they can't figure out, whether it's they've got to acquire new skill sets, how to be a better manager, a better leader. And then some people really need better relationships, how to network with people, how to meet different people um, that may be stuck in maybe a senior executive who doesn't know what they want to do next, right? So it really just depends on the person and really what's going on in their life. Got it. That's a good fit for what I'm doing with the Synergy Cafe and the Synergy Collaborative because I work with like five pillars of career, finance, relationships, spirituality, and wellness. And, uh, you know, if your relationship's screwed up, it's going to affect your finances and your career. And yes, so it's a, sort of a harmonizing all those things together in the yin yep. and the yang, you know? Yes. So where do you do your work? Do you, uh, you do online coaching or do you have an office where you bring people in or go into their offices? or? It's either I do it on the phone or I go to their uh, location in their office. So it just depends whether it's local or somewhere else or someone wants to actually have me travel and come out. So it really just depends on the engagement and things that I'm working on with, a, with an organization or person. Do you, do you do seminars and stuff too, like speak? I do. Yeah, I do. I work with sales uh, a lot uh, and helping them trying to get to the next level because a lot of times with, for sales management and for people, it's not the skills that they need to be better sellers. It's how the behavior, it's the relationship building. Um, and it's also people who are managing those people too. How do you build better relationship with them? How do you motivate them? How do you build really an effective overall organizational culture that creates extraordinary results and where people are happy every day coming into work? Yeah, that's what uh, me and a friend, we've been talking a lot about that, is it's easy to generate a lead, and it's fairly easy to close a sale once a relationship's built. It's that big relationship that's in the middle of the whole thing that uh, you got to keep yes. going through that whole process. Yes, and that becomes very difficult for people. So before I ask my favorite question, I'm almost kind of curious. Are you like an AM guy or a PM guy? You like to get up and get it done in the morning, or are you like burning the midnight oil to get your work done? Uh, you know, it's a combination, but I definitely like the silence of midnight rather than the silence of 5 a.m. to work if I have to. Oh, really? if, if the choice were making it there, it would probably be there. So that's a, that's just how I, how I work better. Got it. Yeah, we're opposites. I like to wake up in the morning and see the sun come up and the birds and all that kind of stuff. But some people like yep. to when it's shutting down. It's always kind of interesting how people, different people work different ways like that. So... Here's one of my favorite questions, and this is pretty much my final question. It's the big why question, and then I'd like to ask uh, how do people get a hold of you and sure. uh, if you've got any upcoming programs that you're offering and launching. So here's the big why question. Why is it you're doing this, and why aren't you like a dog trainer or why not a, maybe a billiards pro? or why, you, why did you pick this to do for a career? Well, I mean, relationship building human behavior is what I'm really good at. I mean, I can just do this pretty much in my sleep. I mean, I've really been able to do this all my life and to connect with people and really understand them. So for me, it's been a natural synergy. And I found out through my career, I was having uh, highs and lows. And it was because I was in the wrong job and, and doing the wrong thing. And I was working for someone else. So 
when I ultimately recognized that, then I got a lot of coaching and work with some amazing people that are really well known now um, and how to help people affect change from the inside out. Right, Because the outside I can help people with because I'm gifted and I can learn a little bit and then I can run with it. But learning how to create quick behavioral changes is, is an art and a science and it's very difficult. And most of the people who do what I do can't do it. So I wanted to help people that way. So for me, that's what really gets me excited and motivated. So every day I wake up and it's not, uh, it's not a job. It's something that I love to do and that I'm really good at. And so for me, that's just a natural progression to kind of take this. But it was hard to be an entrepreneur later. So I had to learn how to <laughs> the ups and downs and still trying to uh, navigate that world. because It's way different. Um, and, and the bigger success you have the more hurdles and challenges you start to get. It doesn't really get easier. It just gets more challenging. Right. Yeah. I heard that uh, little people piece in there about helping people. And that seems to be a common thread to everybody that asked the big why that's always in there somewhere about that. That's what they want to do is they want to help people. So there's help, yes. but there's hope for humanity, so to speak. <laughs> I think there's a lot of help for humanity. So do you have uh, anything that you're launching now, a book that you got out or a program that, uh, that you got, online thing or anything like that? Nothing that's nothing yet that's happening, but there's a lot of things on the horizon that I'm sort of working on, but they're not far enough ahead to tell people, well, go do, to go do this or go watch out for this yet. But it's all the stuff is coming in a very short period of time. There's a lot of stuff I've been working on, so it just depends on which one gets out of the door first. So then how about a website or something that people can get on, maybe get on sure. your mailing list or something like yep. that or social media? Go to uh, jasontroy.com. Uh, it's jasontreu.com. That's jasontreu.com. And there's all my social media channels. And I've got a book, Social Wealth. It's done really well. And it's on how to build extraordinary personal and professional relationships. It's a blue, blueprint, a how to guide for people that's relatively short. And uh, it's helped, I think it's sold now like 45,000 copies of the book in about two wow. years. So it's a. Uh, gotten a lot of good reviews on Amazon. And so that's a great starting point for people. And then I have coaching options for people who want to take it to the next level and work with me on there. And so uh, that's what I've got. Perfect. Well, I'm going to take this and this recording and then we'll take it and beam it up to YouTube and propagate it out to the internet. And uh, hopefully people can find you and they can link to you and get connected, whether they be uh, down there in Texas or up here in Minneapolis or anywhere in the world, I'm assuming. That's right. It's really anywhere <laughs> these okay. days. Okay. I appreciate you taking the time here on Synergy Cafe. Thank you very much, Jason. Be well. Thank you.